Protein bars. So when it comes to protein bars, they're not in my typical nutritional plans that I do for members. However, there are very few to choose from that do follow some, some of my macronutrient requests. So uh, in terms of protein bars, most of it, let's just start with the bad stuff. Most of it is just gimmicky marketing. They add in a few nuts, increase the protein content, and there you go, we think it's healthy because of marketing and it's not this protein bar in particular has tons of sugar it's got 20 grams of sugar it's high in carbohydrates i mean really it's a chocolate bar uh, another one is the quest bar quest is actually one of the only ones that follow within my requirements it's around 200 calories again um, very low in sugar only one gram of sugar it's got fiber it's got 21 grams of carbohydrates um, and 21 grams of protein. I do enjoy this one. I'm definitely okay with this one. Uh, other than that, uh, Susie Goodfat's also a good one in terms of it's got uh, lower carbohydrate value actually. It's got only uh, 13 grams of carbs. So one of the lower ones. It tastes fairly light too, so you can tell there's not much in it. But all in all, you know, you have to ask yourself, why are you eating this protein bar? Is it to actually satiate your appetite? Because they contain no real nutrients that you need for your nutritional plan. So you're probably just having it because you're having a sugar craving. So be mindful, you know, one to three times a week maximum and read your labels.